What's up YouTube? Today's video is on my recipe on uh, ABG mix, which is for your terrariums and vivariums. Um, I did a lot of research and found that this is going to be my best recipe. So uh, ABG stands for Atlanta Botanical Garden. So uh, this is what I got. I'll leave the recipe below in the description. So I got tree fern fiber from Josh's Frogs, charcoal, coconut fiber, repti bark, which is pretty much like orchid bark, uh, oak leaves, catapa leaves, I think that's how you pronounce it. It's pretty good for uh, antibacteria and stuff like that. Um, let's see, coconut core, Sphagnum peat moss, all organic. Uh, some long fiber moss and charcoal. But yeah, so I'm gonna uh, put this together. I'm gonna use this as my measuring thing. I think it's like a 10 quart, 2 liter thing. So, one part peat moss. One part of the long fiber moss. Then half of the coconut fiber because coconut fiber doesn't break down very well. So half of that. About a fourth of the core, coconut core. Leaf litter, probably just one handful because you're going to have a, a bedding of leaves on top anyway. Don't need to put too much of this. Like I said, you're going to have a bedding of leaves for your dark frogs anyway. Tree fern is really important from all the research I did. So you're going to do two cups of these, or two jugs. This will give like good, like borrowing for the isopods and whatnot. So two jugs of that. Repti bark. We're gonna do two two jugs of this too. So if you make your own ABG mix, it's a lot cheaper because you're buying everything in bulk. And then the charcoal, organic charcoal, natural. What I do with the charcoal, I buy the cowboy brand and just get put it in a pillowcase and hammer it with a rubber mallet. So 
So I'm gonna do about a, probably a jug and a half of this. Or a jug and a quarter. So that's pretty much it. So just gonna pretty much mix it up. Put a little bit of RO water in it to make it nice and moist. That's pretty much it, much it guys. It's gonna be high drainage. Because you're gonna have like your misting system or whatever. Don't want anything to be soaking wet. Yeah, so it's gonna look like this. Very easy, cheap to do it on bulk. So that's my recipe. Like I said, I'll put just put it all in the description. And that's pretty much it. And here's the give you guys a sneak peek of the build I just finished. I should have made a video on how to build this, but oh well. So stay tuned, I'm gonna be making a video on this. Alright, peace guys.